The Rubicon features the E-Trax S20 solid cover stock and the new mild asymmetric rondure core. E-Trax is a cleaner and more responsive formula like R2S but is stronger overall. The new Rondeur core in 15 pounds has a 249 RG, 052 differential, and an 011 split or intermediate differential. The RG and diff are exactly the same as the Idols and there's somewhat of a shape difference, but especially when comparing it to the Idol Pro, which shares the same base cover formula, you can see extra traction and aggression down lane out of the Rubicon. It's very reminiscent of balls like the Codex and Alpha Crux, which were higher traction balls with a firm and predictable motion down lane, but still with a focus on control. With 1 being the lowest and 10 being the highest, my hook rating is 8, my length rating is 5, and my back end strength rating is is 6. The Rubicon's hook potential is closest to the Phase 2, the length is closest to the RSTX1, and the back end is closest to the Axiom Pearl. The Phase 2 features the now goaded combination of the TX16 solid cover stock and the symmetric velocity core. TX16 was used only once stateside but is a chemically enhanced and very balanced cover. It gets traction early without slowing down too early and creates a consistent and predictable amount of shape. The Velocity Core comes in at a 248 RG and an 051 differential in 15 pounds and has become legendary as the Phase 2 rose to become one of the premier sport condition balls in the entire industry, becoming a favorite of many of the pros and perhaps most notably for Chris Prather. Velocity is quick revving but at the same time very even and continuous, it just keeps winding and climbing. The combination of the cover and core has created one of the most consistent and versatile balls in the industry and company history. With 1 being the lowest and 10 being the highest, I rate the Phase 2 an 8 in hook, a 5 in length, and a 4 in back end strength. It's closest to the Rubicon in hook, the IQ Tornado Pearl in length, and the Hustle PBR in back end strength. Thanks for watching and may the strikes be with you.